If we pull all nine wands, every single duplicate wand will be given away to you guys. Hey, Harry Potter fans, Peter Kenneth here. Welcome to the Potter Collector Channel, where we are a community of collectors. This is a magical sight. I love this time of the year because this time of the year is mystery wand time of the year. The Noble Collection has released a new series of mystery wands. This is series six, you guys. How crazy is that, that we've been opening these for six different series? And what's special about this series is it features wands from characters from Fantastic Beasts. And there's also something else on here that you can collect. Random magical creature icons to mix and match and a display stand. So we're gonna look at all these things. The goal is to collect all nine of these mystery wands. That's a big goal and we can do it. We've done it for all five series and I know that we can do it again for this one. But I am a little bit afraid of one thing, which I'll tell you about in a second. Let's take a look at the different wands and characters you can pull. So we have Albus Dumbledore, Credence Barebone, Gellert Grindelwald, Lita Lestrange, Newt Scamander, Nicholas Flamel, Queenie Goldstein, Rudolph Spielman, and Tina Goldstein. So those are the different wands that we need to pull to collect all nine. And then the creature icons are the Augury, the Bow Truckle, Chupacabra, Demi Guys, Nagini, Niffler, Nakami, Thestral, ooh, I love Thestrals, and a Thunderbird. I'm nervous about two things. One thing I'm nervous about, we wanna pull all nine of the wands, but also all of the different creature icons. I don't know if like each creature icon is paired with a specific wand, or if they're just randomly inserted into the packages, meaning we have to collect all nine wands and find all nine icons. So. So we'll see. As we open them, we'll see. The other thing I'm nervous about is the fact that these are true random packages. That wasn't true for series three through five. For series three through five, if you purchased a full box of nine wands, you were guaranteed a full set. Noble Collection has gone back to random wands. So I have 24 wands here, but don't know if all nine wands are here. You can purchase these at Walmart. They're a little bit hard to find, but keep searching because they will show up at your Walmart eventually. There's only one way to find out if all nine wands are here, and that is to open them. And if we pull all nine wands, every single duplicate wand will be given away to you guys. So that means if we have to open all 24 of these wands and we find the last wand in the last pack, there will be 15 chances for you to win a wand, 15 different winners. So what I need you to do is send magic through your screen. I know it seems weird, but send magic so that we can find all nine of these wands. Let the nervousness begin. I'm legitimately nervous though, because I don't want this to be the one series that we don't pull all the wands. But let's take a look at the wand box underneath the wrapper real quick. Very fun design. We have Fantastic Beasts, The Wizarding World on the front and then copyright info on the back. I don't know why I'm nervous to open up the first one because we have to open up the first one anyway. Queenie Goldstein, Miss Queenie Goldstein. Ooh, these are better quality than the previous series. This almost feels like Noble Collection wand material, like their premium wand material. These are nice. These were designed to be a little bit more like toys and you can kind of play roughly with them. Even though you shouldn't play roughly with them, you might poke a fellow Witcher Wizard's eye out, but the quality has improved, at least for the Queenie Goldstein wand. Look at that paint job and shimmer. That's really, really nice. And then again, the quality of the wand feels a little bit more like a Noble Collection wand. It still has a little bit of a bend to it, but overall, this is shaping up to be the best series yet. Let's take a look at Queenie's stand. Oh, we have the Demiguise. The very first creature icon is the Demiguise. And on the back, there is some 3M adhesive. So I don't know if you're supposed to... Oh, you are. You're supposed to add it to your stand here. So here is the stand for the Fantastic Beasts series. As you can see, it says Queenie Goldstein on there. And then it lays like this, and we see Queenie Goldstein again, written on the base of the stand, and then the Wizarding World logo. And the wand goes into this little area there and stands up like that. So you can display the wand in all of its glory. 
on your shelf. But the icon is then attached, if you want to attach it, to this portion here to give it a more 3D magical beast's appearance. So there's the stand with the creature icon on it. If we open up another Queenie Goldstein wand and pull the demiguise, I think we'll be pretty safe to know that a specific creature is matched with a specific character. Eight more to pull. Eight more wands to pull right now. We got the other Goldstein sister, Tina Goldstein. We have pulled Tina Goldstein's wand. Now this one feels a little bit more like a mystery wand. It's a little bit thicker than the collectible version from Noble Collection, but here is Tina Goldstein's wand. And the thing I like about Tina's wand is it feels more like the original wands that we saw in Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone or Philosopher's Stone and the Chamber of Secrets movies. They're a little simpler, not as ornate. Tina Goldstein comes with Nagini. The Nagini creature icon, doo doo doo, who actually isn't really a magical beast at all. Nagini is a person who turned into a snake. And here is Miss Queenie Goldstein's wand and stand. Stay. I know the snake is scary, but you just gotta stay in your wand stand. Now, in case you're wondering and you haven't seen a previous mystery wand unboxing in the past, first of all, welcome to the Potter Collector channel. We're happy to have you here. And second, these packages have no indication about what wand might be wrapped inside of the packaging. They are true mystery wands. All right, we have two, let's make it three. We have the Elder Wand, Grindelwald's Wand, but spoiler alert, it's gonna be Dumbledore's Wand. Now this one is very similar to the Elder Wands that we have pulled from previous Mystery Wand unboxings. It's a little bit shorter, good for cosplay, and that's another thing about these Mystery Wands, is they are good for cosplay. If you don't wanna take out your collectible version wand, that's another option for you. But here is the Elder Wand the most powerful wand in the world. And let's see what magical creature icon comes with the Elder Wand. The Augury. If these character icons are matched with a specific wand, the Thestral would have been more appropriate because if you didn't know, the Elder Wand core is a Thestral hair. It's the only wand that uses a Thestral hair for its magic. So here is the Elder Wand in the stand. There we have the Augury icon. And here is my future wand said Dumbledore. Four for four, keep sending that magic so that we can pull all nine wands. Dun dun na na. Oh. Four, four, four. Rudolph Spielman's wand, which is very architectural and I was gonna say delicious. It is very architecturally delicious, but how cool is that handle? Isn't that awesome? I love the squared look. It feels like ancient Rome times or something. It was a wand that was passed down from generation to generation, Spielman to Spielman. And this one, like Queenie Goldstein's wand, is of that kind of higher quality feel when compared to previous mystery wands. So this is also a really nice mystery wand. Spielman's wand, let's see who he gets for a magical creature, the Akami. All right, so we haven't pulled a duplicate magical creature icon yet, which makes me hopeful that we won't have to try to collect them all after we've pulled all nine wands. I say after we've pulled all nine wands because you guys are sending all that magic. We're gonna pull all nine wands. Here is the Akami magical creature icon. Akami is an amazing amazing magical creature, by the way. Oh, and you may have noticed I'm wearing the Mystery Wand Video Lucky shirt. I've worn this shirt for every single Mystery Wand unboxing and every single time we've pulled all nine wands. I hope the luck doesn't run out. Let's not test the luck though. Send the magic. Just in case the luck does run out, at least we'll have the magic too. Who's it gonna be? Queenie Goldstein. But we pulled a duplicate, so this may tell us if the icons are matched with someone specific. <gasps> They're not. Now I'm really nervous. That was like a double bad. It was our first duplicate. And although I love this magical creature, we pulled a Thestral, which is not the creature that came with Queenie Goldstein's wand. <gasps> Nobody panic. We have the lucky shirt. We have the magic that you're sending. Nobody panic. I'm not panicking. I'm fine, guys. I'm fine. I'm fine. Send that magic, especially now, especially now, send that magic. <sighs> okay. 
Dumbledore's wands. We have pulled five of the nine wands. And again, this is a higher quality. Now this isn't metal, like the collectible replicas. These two silver portions are actual metal on the wand, but the rest of the wand feels kind of like the high quality Noble Collection replica. We have that rune on the end of the handle. And here we have Dumbledore's wand with that twisted branch design. All right, so now what creature icon did we pull? Something new, the Akami. <gasps> oh my gosh, okay. It's not time to panic yet. We still have plenty of wands to open up. Let's take a look at Dumbledore's wand in the stand. And actually what I want to do is take the augury icon off or it sets and I'm gonna put the augury on Dumbledore's stand and then the Thestral on the Elder Wand stand. So here is Dumbledore's wand on the stand. And now we have the Thestral attached to Gellert Grindelwald's stand. Now, we don't have to pull all nine of the icons in order to open up the giveaway, just all nine wands. So the giveaway will still happen, even if we don't pull all nine of the icons, but I really do want to pull all of the nine icons. All right, let's make this number six. <sighs> Spielman. And the icon is something new, the Demi guys. Oh guys, it's the Demi guys. We've already pulled the Demi guys, you guys. Now I'm getting nervous, you Demi guys. This is terrifying. Credence Barebone! Look at that. I mean, this wand is really cool. It is also very kind of architectural looking. On the end, we have a little silver detail. What creature did we pull with Credence? A Thestral. Oh no. So I'm not gonna put the magical icon on just yet in case we pull all of the magical icons so that we can have all the nine wands as well as all of the different icons. Put his wand in the stand and put it aside for now. Keep sending the magic. And you're probably sending magic like, don't let Peter open all nine wands until the last one so that there are 15 wands to give away. And that's fine too. As long as we pull all nine wands, that's all that matters. Give us a seventh wand, magical number seven. The Elder Wand, Demi Guys. We pulled the Elder Wand with the Demi Guys, you guys. Give us a new wand. <sighs> Tina Goldstein, the Akami, oh my gosh. Oh, you guys, we did pull the Akami, right? Yeah. This is probably the scariest series that Noble Collection has released so far. They are truly random icons. Send the magic! There's still plenty of wands. Plenty of wands. The Thunderbird! We pulled the Thunderbird! We got a new icon. Oh my gosh. <gasps> That's so exciting. They're underneath like the little thing right here. So you don't know what it is until you pull it out. We're gonna put the Thunderbird on Credence's wand stand and add it to our collection. All right, so we have six wands and six creatures. We need three more of each. All right, so we still need Lita Lestrange, Newt Scamander, and Nicholas Flamel. So the three wands that are in the center right there. And the icons we need, we need the Niffler, the Chupacabra, and the Bow Truckle. This is really stressing me out. At least for the other three past three series, we... <gasps> Nicholas Flamel! Nicholas Flamel! We pulled Nicholas Flamel's wand. We need two more wands and three more creatures. This is a really good toy replica of Nicholas Flamel's wand. There we see like the bone detail on the handle with that gold design and then the brown shaft of the wand. <sighs> This was a joy to unbox. Let's see if we get a double joy and a new creature icon. You guys are seeing it first, although I'm gonna see it down here, Nagini. That's all right, but I am gonna put this aside for now and wait to put on an icon that we haven't pulled yet. 10 more wands, 10 more chances to get all of the icons, all of the wands. Hey, if we pull Nicholas Flamel. Another Nicholas Flamel wand, but what I was gonna say is if we pull all nine wands and all nine icons, then I will give away any duplicates and unopened packages. So if we pull all nine of each thing, there will be 15 chances to win a wand, whether it's been opened or unopened. But in order to do that, we have to pull all of the nine icons as well, which... Chupacabra! We got the Chupacabra! Chupacabra! Whoop, whoop, whoop. 
We need two of each. Two of each. <gasps> we can do it. I know we can do it. Send the magic. There it is. The Chew Pacabra icon. Now really this should go on Gellert Grindelwald's stand, but I like the Thestral on the Gellert Grindelwald stand instead. It would have been even crazier if we opened up a new wand and a new icon in the same box. We can still do that. We can still do it. Newt Scamander and Lita Lestrange. Two best friends at school. Lita or Newt? Lita Lestrange! We pulled Lita Lestrange, we need one more wand, Mr. Newt's commander. Let's, before we look at the wand, look at the icon. We need the bow truckle and something else, Thunderbird, but that's okay. We have pulled Lita Lestrange's wand. I'm gonna wait to put the icon on the stand, but look at that detailed wand right there. Super cool handle, silver and black. Miss Lita Lestrange. Oh my gosh. This is gonna happen, you guys. This is going to happen. We got this, yum. Newt Scamander, send that magic. Nicholas Flamel, but we still need two more icons. The Niffler! We need a bow truckle, AKA Picket, and Newt Scamander's wand. I mean, obviously all these magical creatures are kind of Newt Scamander's creatures, but it's interesting that those are the last two that we have to pull. This is crazy. All right, I'm feeling pumped up. I'm not very nervous anymore, but that doesn't mean we're gonna pull all the nine wands and nine creature icons. Them being random, this is gonna be difficult to pull the last one. So let's not get too excited yet, but get excited because we need one more icon and one more wand. And again, if we pull all nine icons and all nine wands, I will give away every duplicate and every unopened package. This could potentially be the largest mystery wand unboxing giveaway that we've ever done here on the channel. So send that magic. Newt Scamander, pick it. Credence Barebone, Credence Barebone. But do we have a bow truckle? Do we have a bow truckle? Niffler. Magic and lucky shirt. <sighs> Lito Strange, the Chupacabra. Send magic, send magic for a newt. <sighs> Spielman, the bow truckle. <sighs> the Niffler. The Niffler in me is not very excited. This one feels a little lighter than the others. And I know Newt's wand is pretty thin. Let's see if the magic is telling me something. Are you guys just sending me a lot of magic and this is gonna be Newt's wand? It's gonna be the Elder Wand, or Geller Grindelwald's Wand. But maybe it's lighter because a bow truckle is very small and very light. Thunderbird. We have never not pulled all nine wands. I really just wanna pull all nine wands. I wanna pull all nine of both, but at least all nine wands. Come on, give us Newt Scamander's wand right now. Ah, Credence Barebone. Come on, give us, pick it. The bow truckle! <laughs> the bow truckle! If Newt's wand is in here, we've pulled all nine of each one. I know that we can do this. <sighs> Come on. Newt Scamander. Newt Scamander! We pulled all nine of each one. We did it! We actually did it! With three wands to spare, we pulled all nine wands, all nine icons. I was actually thinking there's no way this is gonna happen this time. This is gonna be the first mystery wand unboxing that we've not pulled all of the wands and obviously not pulled all the icons. I wonder if we have a picket and a newt. We have a picket and a newt! We've got a picket and a newt! We just pulled a picket and a newt! Picket and a newt, a picket and a newt. We pulled a picket and a newt. So I have to put this picket or bow truckle onto this particular stand because that's where we pulled it from. Look, here's proof. We pulled two pickets or two bow truckles. If we hadn't pulled the bow truckle in the previous one, we would be freaking out. I mean, we're already freaking out, but we would have been freaking out like crazy if we had opened this and then seen that we had pulled the last icon too. Guys, we did it. We pulled all nine wands all nine icons, which means there is going to be a giveaway for all of the duplicates, as well as the remaining three unopened packages. 
15 chances. Have we ever done 15 chances? That's crazy. 15 of you are going to win a wand. That's insane. Well, let's get calm for a second and take a look at Newt's wand as well as his stand. Stay calm. Peter, are you crazy? Stay calm. We just pulled all nine wands and all nine icons. So there's the icon of the bow truckle. And then here is Newt Scamander's wand as we know it with the mother of pearl detail on the inside there. <sighs> oh, cool, I see the detail. So on the collectible version of the wand, as well as the wand that they use in the Fantastic Beasts films, there are bite marks on it because we see the wand in Newt Scamander's mouth all the time. There are bite marks on this one too. The nervousness was so real, but you guys pulled through again by sending that magic. The lucky shirt pulled through again by being lucky. I'm so proud of us. I'm so proud of us. So giveaway, before I give you details about the giveaway, I have to tell you something very important about scammers here on the Potter Collector channel when it comes to giveaways. You may have seen my social media posts warning you guys, but I wanna tell you right here, right now, in a giveaway video, because this has become a giveaway video, I will never ask you guys to contact me via text, via Telegram, or WhatsApp, or any messaging service like that. I will contact you via a comment reply, and always make sure that the comment that is replying to your comment is from the official Potter Collector channel. Simple ways that you can do that is look for the official check mark next to the Potter Collector name, or click on the Potter Collector name, which will bring you to the Potter Collector channel. It should bring you to the Potter Collector channel. One of the new things I'm doing to prevent these scammers is by me emailing you. They don't have your email addresses, but I do because that's one of the steps to enter the giveaway. You're going to have to enter on thepottercollector.com and have your email typed in there. Then I will contact you via email to let you know if you've won. One other thing, I will never ask you to pay anything if you won a giveaway. These scam artists want you to send them money. These sweepstakes that I do on the Potter Collector channel are always free with shipping included. I pay the shipping cost. You will never have to pay anything if you are a sweepstakes winner. So constant vigilance and let's keep those scammers out of the Potter Collector community. On to the giveaway. This is open to everyone in the world and as I mentioned, shipping is included. I will ship your prize anywhere in the world. Check the description down below for all the information. Make sure you're reading all of it and following all of the steps. This giveaway specifically, I ask people to verify that they have completed each of the steps. Only one entry per person and there's also information about how and when the winners will be selected. Thank you guys for sending the magic. Thank you guys for watching. This was an absolute blast. This is probably the most fun mystery wand set that we've done here because we had that extra thing we had to collect and those creature icons were terrifying. So these are available to purchase at Walmart. So keep checking your Walmart in the toy section if you would like to purchase some of these mystery wands, but they are true mystery wands, so be careful. But hey, we pulled all nine of each in 21 packs. That's pretty darn good, I would say. Pretty darn good indeed. If you have any questions about Harry Potter or collecting, feel free to leave a comment down below. You can also join the Potter Collector on Instagram at the Potter Collector or on Twitter at Potter Collector. Now it's time to like, comment, subscribe, and until next time, keep collecting. Thank you so much for watching, and if you're new here, welcome. We cover all things Harry Potter on the Potter Collector channel, like books, merchandise reviews, unboxings, Wizarding World of Harry Potter videos, and more. If you would like to subscribe, you can click right here. You can also check out a previously posted video right around here. If you have any questions about Harry Potter, feel free to leave a comment down below. I am happy to help. But for now, I must go. We'll see you next time. Whoa, where'd he go?